What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Script the Legend, bringing you guys another YouTube video. This one's on Solana, my favorite chain token. There, yeah, I'm gonna say it, my favorite chain token. I think there's there are only two like immediate competitors, are Avax and Binance or BNB, right? And if you want to bring up Ethereum, sure, but that's like bringing up. Google is a direct competitor of a small startup tech company. Nah, <laughs> nah. Every niche, everything that Ethereum is, it's just versatile. While Solana, AVAX, and BNB are still building their identities. But Solana seems to be the most successful out of all of them. While they have grown with not just bitcoin but also at their own pace they're now at a market cap of 92 billion dollars and i remember like if you asked people like earlier uh last year especially back at 51 dollars hey you think solana is going to be a 100 billion dollar token <laughs> people would be like in 2028 yeah <laughs> but it is the case now and i think a lot of people are happy about that i want to go into some of the one i want to talk about the sentiment what the solana sentiment and community sentiment is heavily bullish so they're running up for the last month they're up 40 percent and the bull and the sentiment is still bullish now there are some people in the crypto community that are not the most wisest in the crypto community is known for being a little brash sometimes but it makes sense solana has actually continued this consistency for a whole year not only that they are number four token now not only that there are a lot there are tokens that are leaving Bi binance they're leaving avax they're leaving competitors of solana to come to the solana chain a fast growing uh token with that we get into some of the trading analysis look look let's look at how people are buying it especially on their biggest pair the solana to usdt pair on binance we go to the trading data and we can see for last a day there has been some small sales oh oh ho oh, oh, ho oh, oh. my misspoke on my end my fault we've seen large buys that are actually losing to the large sales we see medium buys losing to the medium sales and we see small buys losing to the medium or beating the small sales and the overall inflow is negative overall wise it is negative if you look at this spread out for the last 24 hours you can see that the flow from the last five days has been largely positive today we see a negative inflow like we said for the last 24 hours of negative 217,000 uh solana being traded uh or being um who leaning more to the soul size but we had 186,000 then 185,000 then 413,000 and then 180,000 so last five days is looking really really good and i'm not even upset honestly i would be totally fine if i didn't see this metric right here for the last five days because the thing i wanted to push home is a little bit of realism to the Solana buyers and or people that are thinking, right? This is all entertainment at the end of the day, though. This is all entertainment. Uh, I'm not trying to sway anybody's opinion, but cryptos do drop. We look at the last day, they're down 0.38%. But if we break this back out to seven days, we see that they did have a drop earlier this week. And if we break this down into a month, we do see that there's drops every here and there in the chart. So I want people to know, yes, the drops are going to happen. And we should always be vigilant. Not even just when the prices are rising or when the prices are dropping. But at all times, we should be vigilant even when the price is down 0.38% or up 0.38%. Do not grow twitchy aggressive and get apprehensive because of a day of bad trading 
or a day of the bull run not going the way that you want it to go. I'm sure there's plenty of people that want to see Bitcoin boom 400% in one day and be like, yes, the greatest day of my life. And there's some people that want to see Solana run 150,000% and say the greatest day of my life. I'm a millionaire. I'm selling. I'm selling. But it's also we also have to keep in mind that there's people that are also in the realm of normality that are selling because they have things they have to manage in life. Just like myself, I just had to pay 2500 or 2300 to be specific for my car's repair repairment. So yeah, 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 yeah. Life happens and I did not see it coming. All I got was a check engine light, looked up what that check engine light means, and I knew when I went to that dealership, it wasn't going to be the best day of my life, <laughs> no matter what Bitcoin was doing. But you guys have a blessed one and stay safe. This is the Script Legend signing out. Peace.